filter and restore higher flow rates, you simply fill your reservoir about a quarter of the way full, attach the filter, and shake it for 30 seconds. We have an open line of communication with our customer service team and Seattle Repair Shop. Early on in developing the quick draw, we asked them, what's the biggest problem people have with their water filter? And they told us the same thing we found online, clogging. Nothing's more frustrating on a trip than watching clean water barely trickle through your filter. We knew we wanted a filter that was capable of reliable and fast filtration for months straight on the trail while still being ultra light, which is why we designed the Quick Draw to be a shake to clean filter with the best hollow fiber tech available. Another question we asked ourselves was how should a filter perform when it's not being used? On the go filtration demands quick access and storage. Rolling up the filter cartridge in the reservoir creates a compact package that easily slides into external pockets on backpacks or fits in a small nook of space inside a pack. Much like our other hollow fiber filters, proper long-term storage is also important to maximize the life of the quick draw. Filter one liter of clean water through the filter, then fill the reservoir with a liter of clean water and add two and a half milliliters or a half a teaspoon of household bleach with a chlorine concentration between five and 8%. Or you can use 10 aqua tabs. Filter a half liter of solution through the system and let it sit 30 to 60 minutes then filter the remaining solution through the filter. Once the reservoir is empty, detach the filter and put on the dirty side cap. Towel off the filter in the reservoir and allow it to finish drying before putting away. When it's dry, roll the filter up in the reservoir and try not to lose it in your gear closet. It's okay to store the hollow fibers wet or dry. If they are stored wet, it's important that they have been disinfected and are kept at a temperature above freezing. I'd like to talk about a particularly key feature of the quick draw that sets an important standard in the personal filter category. Safety. Whether it's the hollow fiber in our platy microfilters or Sawyer's or Catadines, if you drop the filter or it freezes when it's wet, you run the risk of damaging the fibers. Given there are hundreds of little fibers in a tight bundle, it's impossible for a user to visually tell if the cartridge has been compromised. Being reliable means being able to know if the filter has been compromised, right? Perhaps you should ask our competitors that question. Unlike their fill and squeeze filters, the Quick Draw has a simple integrity check to determine if it's still safe to use after dropping or freezing. Begin by removing the clean side assembly and placing it somewhere where you won't lose it. The fibers must be fully wetted, so filter at least a liter of water through if you haven't used it in a while. Then refill your reservoir with about a half a liter of water. Turn upside down and filter some of the water through the filter. Then flip the container and squeeze air through the filter. Look for a steady stream of bubbles coming out of the top of the filter. A few bubbles initially emerging is fine, but a steady stream indicates the hollow fibers have been compromised. Our team set out to develop a personal filter that will elevate the whole category. To create an affordable filter that offers a fantastic user experience and high performance technology. 